Hello, Dumelang, San Bonani, Molueni, and a warm welcome to the Maths Genius Video Tutorial Series brought to you by SABC Education. In these tutorials, we help you unleash the mathematical genius in you by showing you key mathematical concepts and how you can master them for success like a true genius. Today we're going to be talking about division of fractions. Now, as you know, a fraction is a number that can be represented as A over B, where A is the numerator and B is the denominator. Denominator, right? So, when two fractions are being divided, the rule is as follows. I'll use letters initially, then I'll use numbers to actually uh, explain the concept. So A over B divided by C over D would be equal to A over B times D over C. So this is the law for division of fractions. Now. Before we go into division, let's just do a recap of multiplication so that we'll be able to know what to do after, uh, after converting it into multiplication. Remember, recall that 1 over 2 times 3 over 5, right? If you're multiplying fractions, right? It's going to be numerator times numerator, denominator times denominator. So in this case, it will be equal to 1 times 3 divided by 2 times 5, which is 3 out of 10. That is how you multiply fractions. Multiplication of fractions, remember we said it's what? Numerator times numerator over denominator times denominator. And in this case, we got 3 out of 10. Now, let's go back to division now and say, how do we use this information? So, the basic principle is that when you're multiplying two fractions, right, you keep the first as is, as you have seen here, it's, it has stayed the same. A over B remains as A over B. But the second fraction, it was C out of D. C over D, but now we've inverted it, right? It's called to invert. Right? We've inverted it and now it's become D over C. So D over C is actually the reciprocal of C over D. Right? So, as a rule of thumb, whenever somebody says, how do you divide two fractions? You say, you write the first one as is and you flip over the second one. That is the inverting, where the numerator becomes the denominator and vice versa. So let's try with an example, right? Let's try with uh, the same one, right? Where we're gonna say one over two divided by three out of five, right? Now, it's tempting to just say two divided by five, one divided by five, but remember the golden rule, right? You're going to invert the second one, right? So it's gonna be, the first one remains the same, so it's one out of two, this division sign changes into a multiplication sign. So it's going to be times the division changed into a multiplication. And then the second one is inverted. So it's going to be 5 out of 3. Now it's become easier because we know how to multiply fractions. So the next step now is to say multiplication of fractions is numerator as numerator denominator is denominator. So this is going to be 1 times 5 out of 2 times 3, which is 5 out of 6. That is your result from division of fractions. So just go and look out for more questions and try them, but always remember that the division sign becomes a multiplication. The second fraction is inverted flipped over. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. 
unleash your mathematical genius today. If you have any maths questions, you can post them for free on www.mathsgenius.co.za or email them to info at mathsgenius.co.za.